Hello guys, welcome back to Sports Corner GH. My name is Adam. Guys, I'm not happy at all. Two players who I believe that GFE can convince to switch nationality to come and play for the Black Stars are on their way to Euro 2024. I'm not happy about it at all. And we are going to talk about it live here on Sports Corner GH. Also, we are going to talk about the good news. Mohamed Kudus have been nominated for Premier League team of the season. And also, we are going to talk about the transfer update concerning Daniel Amate amongst many others. So guys, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on notification. Next is shout out. Shout out to every single person watching this video. Thank you for everything. So guys, quickly, let's jump into it. And I would like to begin with the England Provisional Squad list for Euro 2024. And you can see the list on your screen. And if you check the defender's color, you will see the name Jao Kwanza, who plays for Liverpool. This season, he was phenomenal for Liverpool, played a lot of games. He's a ball-playing centre-back who I believed GFA had to do everything in their power to convince this boy to play for the Black Stars. The name Kwanza was given to him because his grandfather played for the Black Stars. So even that alone should be a point we can use to convince the boy. But then no, Garrett Salgate decided to add the young boy, the Ghanaian boy, to the England squad. I mean, this is a provisional squad list, so it could be that he could make the final squad list or he could be dropped. If he's dropped, hallelujah, still there's chance. But then if he's not dropped, I mean, the chances of me getting him would be very slim. And I'm not really happy about it because he is young. He played very well in the EPL with Liverpool this season. And I believe this boy, I mean, he's going to do well. If you partner him with Virgil van Dijk, you could see that their telepathy, their communication, their relationship, everything is matching very well. Now, the next Ghanaian player in this list is Kobe Min. Oh, Kobe Min. Oh, uh, 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 the way the words Kobe Mane with Black Stars. Imagine Kobe Mane with Thomas Pate and then Mohamed Kudus. Ah, voila talai. We are winning everything. I'm telling you. But then England, they look sharp. I mean, I'm not even surprised they included, you know, Kobe Mane to their squad because Kobe Mane has been a key figure for Manchester United this season. And anytime they played, you could see this boy alone stands out for Manchester United. So I'm not even really surprised. Even during the international break, you know, Kobe Menu played for England. He made his debut. He played some games. Even the second game they played, he won one of the match. He he was that good. He impressed Dowd Salgate. So I'm not surprised. I mean, Dowd Salgate in included him to the England Provisional Squad list for the Euro 2024. So these two players decided to choose England over Ghana because they were eligible to play for both countries. I mean, the chance is gone. I believe the chance there is gone. But then GFE, you can still knock on the door. Just in case any of these players do not make the final squad list. But guys, these are players who have joined the England squad, which I'm not happy about it. I believe they have quality that could really, really improve our black stars. Now let's move away from that and talk about Mohamed Kudus. Guys, Mohamed Kudus, and I think he's blessed and blessed beyond control. Yes. Sometimes when you kneel down and you pray, just say, God, give me Mohamed Kudus type of blessing. You know why? Mohamed Kudus, amongst all the West Ham players, have been nominated for Premier League team of the season. And you see, you can see the picture here. He was nominated alongside Jared Bowen. And uh, out of the number of you know, players at West Ham, is Mohamed Kudus and Jared Bowen that were picked out as nominees for team of the season. So guys, I'll leave a link in the description. Click on it. Go and vote for Mohamed Kudus. Go and vote for Mohamed Kudus so that Mohamed Kudus can be in the Premier League team of the season. I'll be really excited to see him there. But then, this is a voting game. So, the more you vote for Mohamed Kudus, the more the player can be there. Eight goals, six assists this season for West Ham in the English Premier League. And I mean, it would be great to see Mohamed Kudus name in there for team of the season. I'm not going to lie to you. His first season in the English Premier League and then making the team of the season that would be wild. That would be very, very wild. But guys, let's vote for Mohamed Kudus. It's very important. If you go there, just vote for Mohamed Kudus. Mohamed Kudus has been important for West Ham. He has played very well. He rose through the ranks, became, became an important player for West Ham. I mean, he has every right and every reason to be in that thing of the season. He is there with a lot of great players, but then I'm not going to lie to you. Mohamed Kudus really, really deserves to be part of the team of the season. So guys, make it possible. Ghanaians, make it possible. Africans, make it possible for Mohamed Kudus to be in 
the EPL team of the season. I'm going to leave a link in the description. Click on it, vote for Mohamed Kudus. So guys, moving away from Mohamed Kudus, let's talk about Daniel Amati. Currently, he plays for Bexitas in the Turkish Super League. The Black Star defender hardly gets playing time quite of late. Now, when he signed from Leicester City to Bexitas, at the beginning of the season, he was playing regularly. But then, for some reason, I think the coach preferred another defender to him because it got to a time his position was changed. He was no longer playing as a defender, he was playing as a DM. And then he was doing well at that position, but I don't know what you know informed the decision of the coach to now bench Daniel Amati. So currently, he does not get a lot of game time. But then, the report we are receiving is that Celtic are interested in signing Daniel Amati. Celtic in the Scottish League are interested in signing Daniel Amati. But then, guess who is the coach of Celtic? Yes, just guess who is the coach of Celtic? It is Brendan Rodgers. Brendan Rodgers, he is the former Leicester City coach. He coached Daniel Amati when he was playing at Leicester City. And then Daniel Amati's former coach won him at Celtic because if you are not playing, you are not getting game minutes at Bexitas. Then why not come to Celtic in the Scottish League? You know, rewrite your story, rewrite your season and see what happens. So, I mean, this is the latest transfer update we are getting on Daniel Amati. Brendan Rodgers won him at Celtic in the Scottish League. So, guys, we'll make sure to follow up on this and bring you more updates. At one time, we saw a report that Inter Milan and AC Milan were observing Daniel Amati's situation. We don't know how far they will go to sign the player. But then currently, the team that we know who are in the front seat to sign Daniel Amati is Celtic because of the influence of his former coach, Brendan Rodgers, who coached him at Leicester City. We'll make sure to follow up on this and bring you more information on Daniel Amati's transfer. So guys, this is the update we have for your life on Sports on IGH. Let me know what you think about Kobe Menu and Daryl Panzer making the England provisional squad for the Euro 2024. Are you happy? Are you sad? Do you think it's okay for them to you know, choose England over Ghana? For me, I'm not happy because, let's be very honest, these players are so good, they have quality, they play in the English Premier League regularly. How many of our young players can we boost that play at that top level? So the experience is there. But then, I mean, what, are, what is done is done. That is what I have to say. What is done is done. But guys, let me know your thoughts about it down below in the comments. And also don't forget to vote for Mohamed Kudush to make the EPL team of the season. My name is Adam. I'll make sure to see you in the next one. Charlie, we go vibe.